In this video, I'll be showing you how to add music to a photo on Android. It's a very simple method. So if you find this video helpful, be sure to drop a like and subscribe. But anyways, getting into it, the first thing you wanna do is head on over to your Google Play Store because you are gonna need an application for this, but it's a completely free application, so don't worry. But it's called CapCut, which a lot of you might already have on your phone anyway, but you just gotta wait for it to install. It's only 197 megabytes on Android, so it doesn't really take long to install at all. But of course, it might vary depending on your internet connection. But once it's downloaded and installed, you just gotta press open, then it's gonna open like this. You gotta to agree to the terms of service, and then you can just press skip on the top right over here. Now from here, you can either make a template or you can what you can do is go to edit on the left and go ahead and click new project and then allow access to your camera roll. You can ask it to send notifications if you want to. Then just select any of the photos that you want in here. So I'm just gonna choose this random photo right here. Then I'm gonna go ahead and click add. So now the photo is in my timeline. Now what I wanna do if I wanna add music in the background is press audio on the bottom left. And now I'm gonna go ahead and click on sounds. Now when you press sounds, uh, CapCut actually has a massive library of music that you can use yourself. So you can just click on any one that you want. Some of them are, you know, behind a premium subscription, but a lot of this music is completely free to use on uh, your Samsung or Android phone, then you just gotta click whichever one you want. However, if you've downloaded music on your phone, like, you know, internally, and it's not on CapCut, what you can do is press this folder icon right here, then just go ahead and click on device, and then any of the things that you've downloaded, for example, these four songs I've downloaded on my phone, I can click on any of these, and then, you know, I've just pressed that, and now it's on my timeline. Once I'm happy with it, I just change the settings over here, and then I just gotta click export on the top right, and it's gonna be exporting to my camera roll, and that's it. Now, if you found this video helpful, be sure to drop a like and subscribe